Do you know each other? No. Okay, well, well that sounds great. I'm telling you. Wow. <laughs> good luck is all I'm saying is you're next. So good luck. <laughs> I'm ready Thank to you. cry, okay? Bye-bye. Bye. Hey! Che ci fate qui fuori? È Halloween, abbiamo fatto dolcetto scherzetto. Siete sole. C'è un inquietante uomo con una maschera bianca. Dove? Sta giocando a nascondino con noi. Dov'è che l'avete visto? Guarda! Oh mio Dio! Scappate! Andate a casa! For me it's a, a big honor to meet you. Thank you. Because uh, you are a symbol for me. Uh, when I was a child, uh, Halloween uh, is my first horror movie and I'm in love with uh, Lori's characters. Mm -hmm. You are uh, a Disney princess, but more, more <laughs> badass. <laughs> so I'm a very bloody Disney princess. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the first uh, final girl, Lori's character, rewrote the um, female characters in the horror movie. Uh, she is uh, the first uh, final girl. Uh, she is not a simple piece of meat. So, have you ever felt the weight of this character uh, responsibility? I think that's a great care, uh, great question. I feel the weight of responsibility in many areas. Um, as you, uh, you know, there was no final girl until there was a final girl. Like we didn't even know what that was. And I do understand now, the last girl standing is the one that fights back. The one that, that, it's hard to quantify why that is and I do feel the responsibility to represent that but more than anything I feel like it's my rep it's my job to represent and fight back against violence in all forms yeah. um, in everything and not only on my screen life but in my personal life in my um, family life that that's become my job that my job is to fight back um, against oppression, wherever it is. Thank you for this. <laughs> Thank you for this. But that is without, I wasn't raised with activist parents. So I'm not an activist, I'm a realist. And th what I know in a real way is that violence has been perpetrated against human beings since the beginning of time, good, evil and that we are all good and evil. Yes. I have evil, I have good. You have evil, you have good. That my job now is to fight back. And um, Carpenter's Halloween isn't just an horror movie, it's a, a political movie, in my opinion. A movie that talks about a certain society. And uh, the movie tells us wake up, evil, evil is everywhere, a child is uh, the evil, and uh, Michael is the king of boogeymen, and he is just a man, doesn't need a fags uh, or, I don't know, a wig. Uh, so I think that Michael is like a virus uh, in the society, a virus uh, like Covid, for example. I don't know what you think about... M I think you should be sitting here and I should be sitting there and I should be asking you to explain to the universe about this because that's a deeper dive than I've heard anybody say, certainly today. Um, I think you're right, and I think the thing that made what David Gordon Green did with the 2018 movie is that he is prescient because he understood that the trauma of women needed to be explored way before the trauma of women erupted around the world in the exact same way that the trauma of a community suffering a group trauma and then the rage, the rage and the brutality that that breeds, again, is only mirrored by society today. And I think the final movie you particularly will be overwhelmed with what David is trying to say because it goes back to the very thing that you said at the beginning. 
okay i don't really ready for to say goodbye to your character uh, in the halloween ends you know it's all good <laughs> it's all good thank you so much thank you so much god man. bless you take care okay, thank you. and uh when you write your book if you need somebody to write the foreword you call me because oh. <laughs> do you know each other no okay well that sounds great I'm telling you, wow. good luck is all I'm saying is you're next. So good luck. I'm ready Thank to you. cry. Okay. Bye bye. Abbiamo ucciso Michael. Mia nonna ha piccato il fuoco. Non te l'hanno detto. Detto cosa? Michael Myers è vivo. Un uomo non sarebbe sopravvissuto a quell'incendio. Quarant'anni fa l'uomo nero è venuto a cercarci. Noi siamo i sopravvissuti a Michael Myers. Lori, che facciamo? Combattiamo. Mamma, lo ucciderà la nostra famiglia. Lo spaneremo e metteremo fine a questa storia. Non smetterà di uccidere finché non lo fermiamo. Guardate dove sono le sue vittime. È una freccia che indica la casa d'infanzia di Michael. C'è qualcuno in casa? Sta venendo a prendermi, ma io prenderò lui. Se vuoi uccidere qualcuno, prendi me! Vai, Tom! Voglio togliergli la maschera e vedere la vita lasciare i suoi occhi.